So Jakob, this is your first big international meet doing the K1 1000 and you win. So well done. <laughs> uh, I, think, I think it was, was nearly a perfect race for me. Uh, I did everything what Max, my trainers, told me and I show every performance that is in me, every engine. So I think that was a great mix. I think there are also something to um, to better, but yeah, I'm pretty happy and I don't think that I can win here. It's my first time to uh, since 2017 that I paddled the K1 about 1,000 meters. 2017 I was a junior and now it's the other game. It's an A-level game and here are the world champions, world record holder, every strong guy with a lot of engine and yeah, I can't told I, uh, I can't say what are my feeling, but I think I'm happy and I'm crying and I'm also confused. Well, yeah, I mean you're already the favourites in the K2 with Max Hoff for Tokyo. Do you think you could do both? Would you like to do both if you can? Uh, of course, I think now I can. I show what I can do in the K1 and it's not only an idea, I think we can do this, the K1 and K2. Um, the World Cup was a race to look whether I can do the K1 and I think I can do it. And you asked yourself some questions, what you're capable of, you've shown now you can do that. Is it going to make you a better K2 paddler as well, do you think, with Max? Well, yesterday I, uh, I said that, that the K2 is my most important boat and that's also now the fact. The K1 is just a desert and I think Max is a great paddler. I can also do something and yeah, we can do both with a perfect place. I'm sure other teams are going to be very scared. Uh, congratulations, Jaco. Great result today. We'll see you in Tokyo. Yeah, thank you very much.